In this tutorial we are going to backtest trades that were previously taken in a live environment, but they will be backtested with alternate stop losses and targets. Start by downloading the files provided from the beta backtest suite. There is a link in the description. By default, the CHT file and SCSS file will be in the downloads folder. They must be moved to the Sierra chart data folder. We'll need trade data to continue. On the title bar hit trade. Then hit trade activity log. Click the trades title. Next hit edit. And select copy all. Switch over to the Excel file provided. Simply paste by pressing. Control. V. On the keyboard to paste into the highlighted S. 8 cell. Select all trades within columns C to M, including the titles by clicking and dragging the mouse over those cells. Then press Ctrl plus C to copy the trades to the clipboard. We are done with the Excel file. Back in Sierra chart it's time to paste the copied data to cell BA2. Right-click the cell and select Paste. Normal Ctrl plus V pasting will not work. Switching over to the order window which should be colored yellow. It's time to configure the orders. Set the trade quantity. In the Targets tab, consider a stop loss and target order. It's possible to use multiple targets and stops. To add orders, press the Add button, then select an order type from the drop down menu. Set the offset distance. Ensure the Use Attached Order box is checked. We're now ready to run the back test. On the title bar hit file and then hit disconnect or press disconnect on the control bar. Simulation mode must be enabled. Then for good measure on the title bar, hit trade, then clear trade simulation order and data. Once again, on the title bar hit trade, then hit auto trade system replay backtest. On the replay window we must set the time and date to begin the backtest. Replay mode is set to accurate trading system backtest mode. And for charts to replay, we set it to all charts in chart book. For speed, set to 100,000. Next, hit play to begin the backtest. Upon completion, the trades can be found by navigating to the title bar and hitting trade, then trade activity log. They are stored in the trades and also the statistics tabs. These stats can be easily exported from the Edit tab. A link to this suite is located in the description, as well as a link to a Sierra chart handbook that's loaded with guides and resources, including more on backtesting. If you enjoyed the video consider liking and subscribing. All of this is for entertainment and educational purposes only. Trading is risky.